this is Head Bust Unboxing, and we are back in the house. And um, I got some good news that I want to share with the boxing community. But um, I'm a little pissed off. But I am going to share the good news, and you will see why I said I'm a little pissed off. Um, remember back in like the first week of June, June 4th, June 5th, something like that. Um, news broke that Melody Taylor was arrested for uh, pulling a gun out on one of his tenants. And by the way, I, I need to clear something up. In the video I did, I said that he was being uh, evicted. That wasn't the case. He was the landlord evicting someone else. But that's what I heard on the local news, so I reported what I heard. But anyway, um, it was a you know it was a big uproar in the sports world. Uh, Yahoo Sports reported it, ESPN reported it, like all the little major, well I ain't gonna say little, but all the major uh, sports networks and columnists and whatnot reported this. But nobody reported that the man got out like a day or two later, nobody. Not one person got on, you know, their high horse and reported that this man was out and doing well. Not one person. Now, I'm a little disgusted by that because if you can report the bad stuff about somebody, you can report the good stuff. So I'm reporting that it's good to hear that the brother is out, got out a, a day or two later, and is doing well. And I found this news out because a brother uh, on my channel, he actually reached out in the comment section and gave me the news and um, I told him I would report it. Actually, he had said something about a week or so ago, but I told him I needed information first. I didn't just want to get on and just start, you know, running my mouth. But um, he found out via Facebook. And um, it turns out he's actually friends with Melody Taylor's brother, Eldred Taylor, on Facebook, and that's how the news got out. In fact, you, you see the post right here where it says, in the words of public enemy, don't believe the hype. And you see some of the comments where, you know, people are coming in and uh, speaking in the comment section about what's going on. And uh, one person in particular asked, is he free again? Well, he, well, one person said, I didn't believe it when I first heard it. And his response is, he's free. That's Eldred, that is. He said, he's free again, don't believe the hype. So the brother is out and from what I hear is doing well. And you see another post, and this is on June the 8th, by the way. The other one was on, was on June the 5th, so that's probably the next day. On June the 8th, you see uh, the post says, you got the right to speak to your own opinions, but know all the facts before you speak, comment, judge, or post. Furthermore, don't believe all the propaganda you hear and read is not always the truth. And one last thing, no one life is squeaky clean or perfect. And it's closing trying and in closing trying to blow out someone else's candles is not going to make your uh, make your blow any brighter. P.S. Why do we live in a world where people are happy and applaud people not doing so good or downfall? And I would have to agree with the brother 100%. And um, like I said, everybody got something to say. Um, I put some of the comments up so you can read what what his brother was saying. Like this one right here says, "He's good and everything will be fine." Thanks again for your concern. So a lot of people reached out to find out uh, whether the brother was I right, was the champ, you know. Is he doing well? Matter of fact, I'm gonna show some of the comments that um, that are in my comment section from the video that I did, just to show, you know, like I said, a lot of people was concerned about the brother, and um, a lot of people wanted to know, you know, whether he was okay or not. So I just wanted to report that and put that out there. And shame on all these news reporters, uh, sports reporters columnists, YouTube channels, Facebook uh, flunkies, and Twitter fingers, and everything else that quickly put out that the man was locked up, and maybe even laughed about it, 
had jokes about it and whatnot, but did not have the nerve or the decency to uh, follow up and find out if he was okay or if he got out or what went down in the situation, however you want to put it. So I'm trying to uh, do the right thing and put out a video to show that the brother is okay. And I didn't have any malice in my heart when I put out the first video. I was, I'm, a, I'm a big fan of Melji Taylor's. Um, he's one of my favorite fighters, especially from the, uh, the early and mid nineties. And um, I just wanted to report the news. But anyway, this is Hair Bustin' Boxing Fight Doctor. Hit me up in the comment section. Let me know what you think about the video. If you was concerned about the champ, uh, well, this is good news for everybody that, that was wondering if he was okay. And uh, hit that like button, hit that share button, hit that subscribe button. This is Hair Bustin' Boxing Fight Doctor. I am out.